My in-store radio is a really effective tool if you want to communicate messages to your customers. It's very simple to install the player. Just connect it to the internet, power, and your store speaker system. Now you and your customers are listening to your very own radio station. Let me show you how to manage My in-store radio. Log into your profile from our website. Pick the kind of music you want to play for your customers. You can either choose to use one of our already defined presets, or you can take control of the music yourself. Move the sliders to set the proportion, that is, the relative amount, of music played from each category. You can change your choice of music at any time. At the bottom, you put in details of the content that will make up your radio programming. Choose how many ads will be included in each commercial break, how many songs you want to play between each commercial break, and how often you want to play jingles. Move on to Ads and Jingles. This is where you can upload messages for your customers. Now I'm going to upload four files, which have already been recorded in advance. When the files have been uploaded, they will be visible in the list below. You can press play to listen to a file, or press edit to rename a file, or you can write a tag or keyword for the file. Click on Schedule Playtime to define when you will permit the ad to be played. You can enter a start date, an end date, and a time interval for each day of the week. If you don't change anything, then the ad will be included in the playlist all seven days of the week, 24 hours a day. If you have an ad that is only permitted to be played sometimes, for example during the month before Christmas, or on warm and sunny days, you can easily change it from active to inactive status and back to active again. Finally, you select whether your file is an advertisement or a jingle. Now save your changes. Shortly after you've saved your changes, you can hear it on the player in the shop. Have fun with my in-store radio.